I wanted to show you guys this one. If you uh, have watched any of my videos before, you guys, I think you know that I absolutely love Tom Brady. And uh, I also love the questions that you guys send me, all right? So, like, this week I had more than a handful of uh, questions saying, hey, Kurt, can, um, can you get out those faint print lines on cards? And uh, can you give us a demo on that? So, unfortunately, you don't have to look very far to find a card with print lines or scratches on it. And this, you guys, is pack pulled. You know, this is Mosaic, brand new. And look at this. Isn't that annoying? That there's a line that goes all the way through them. See it? That goes all the way down. There's a bunch of scratches right here. Bunch right there. And again, this is, of course, out of hobby and something expensive. That of 50. Beautiful card, right? And then, of course, the back just can't be clean. It's got a nice big line across the back. See, look just south of the Patriot logo. See it going all the way across? So let's go at it, guys. Let's see what we can do. And you know, I make my formulas here, you know, the best I can for stuff like this, you guys. But Sometimes stuff is just too beat up, so at least uh, you can reduce a lot of these lines, and hopefully we can remove them. So, as you can see, they're all over this thing. So, thanks for watching, guys. I'm Kurt with Kurt's Card Care, and I make a few handy products right here to go at common issues you'll find on cards. And uh, I'm not going to use cleaning spray. I'm not going to use a corner or edge tool. This card is clean. There's nothing, like, built up on it. It's just scratched up. The corners, edges, take my word for it. I'll say they're a 10. Okay, so let's see if we can get this surface to cooperate. I'm going to use a little bit of Kurt's Card Care, my polish on this. Use a little applicator. And I'm just behind the camera, you guys, just putting a little bit on the applicator, okay? I'll be right in front of it in a second. All right, so that's what I was doing. So I'm going to start, let's just do above the belt first. And you guys, my polish is also just awesome at making a card shine. Um, I do feel that like when I'm looking at this under these lights, the whole prism pretty surface is like dull. Like this whole card has been like rubbed on another card or stuck to it or scratched or just something crappy. So also when you're working on your cards, get comfortable, move them around because I want to pull the polish off from left to right. So let's see what we can do with this thing. Anytime you guys see these minor scratches or lines like this from the factory always give them a polish you guys it's um obviously easy to do and you can reduce all those all that action going on down there and some of them are pretty faint so hopefully we can just remove some of them And you guys see me doing a few multiple applications here. Feel free to do that. You're not going to ever hurt your card with the polish. It's good stuff. And you wipe it off. It's just sometimes I think that these lines can be like riding on the top of the clear coat surface. And if that's the case, you can usually get a little successful at pulling them off. From my angle, guys, they're definitely uh, the fuzzy little baby ones are starting to go away. That main one going right up and down the card north to south, that one's still 
present. They're all on this side too. Let's flip it around the other way. I'm gonna do the same thing, guys. I'm just gonna reapply a little bit of polish here. And guys, if this is your first time ever checking me out or watching this and going, what the heck is this guy doing here? Um, again, I'm Kurt and I personally, guys, formulate and make the polish, the spray, the corner tool. I got sick of cards coming like this for years and years, so I figured I gotta take it into my own hands. And that's when I started developing these products that are safe for cards. And I don't put anything in them that's gonna screw up your card, of course, guys. I Opposite, I wanna put stuff in here that's gonna help collectors out, that's gonna hopefully alleviate some frustration when you spend a ton of money on a box of cards and you get the one you're looking for and it comes messed up. But anyways, I don't put any sort of like colors or fragrances or no sort of abrasives, you guys. There's nothing in here that's gonna like peel the clear coat down. Um, I don't mess around. I just wanna help you guys clean cards and return them to the original look. Mm, it's looking pretty good, you guys, but I'm just such a perfectionist that I hate it when there's scratches on there still. So this blue area cleaned up really good. See? But look, there's still some of those damn ones right there in his wrist. It's just too sharp. I mean, yes, of course. Better? Yes. 100% gone? No. It reduced it pretty good, though. I'm going to do a couple more layers. I'm gonna try to keep this to be a, a brief video, you guys. So hang with me, let's see if we can get it to look any better, and then we'll flip it over and do the back. And even if you can't remove every single line, you guys, on a card, it's just, I don't know if it's just me, but it's satisfying to improve it, make it look better, especially if you grade your cards. I imagine there's a threshold for, you know, X amount of scratches equals this grade, and clearly if you can pull a lot of them off, it's gonna give you a better surface approach for sure. Some of these ones at the bottom, you guys, I'm putting the polish on and I can just see the cards. I can just see it stuck, the um, the scratch just stuck into the surface. Like, look. Hmm. Some of these are scratches down there. But let's, let's pull off the polish and see the results. And you know what, that's as good as it's gonna get, so. That's that. Always, you guys, like when you see me use my towel and I pull it away, I'm always rolling it because I don't want to um, keep on smearing polish all over it. Again, you're not going to hurt anything, but it's just nice to get the job done fast. Faster you can clean up a card, you know, moving... Speed's not the name of the game, but my point is get it cleaned up and put it away or get it cleaned up and send it off to get graded. This is going to be my last swipe on the front and then we're going to flip it over. All right, let's take a look. Definitely shinier. I'm happy with this. That cleared up good. That whole blue uh, octagon or whatever behind him. Couldn't get all those damn ones off of the arm. See that? They're getting there real good. And the one at the bottom was sharp. Sharp. So, improvement, yes, you guys. Are they all gone? No but I'll take it. 
it's like I said, it's so damn frustrating when you, you know, buy an out to a break or go buy a whole box or a couple boxes and you see this one and you're like, yes. And then after the initial buzz wears off of saying yes, you look at it and go, oh, geez, what the heck happened to this thing? All right, I'll fiddle around with it more after I get off the video, you guys, and then I will, um, I'll take some pictures of it. But let's see if we can do anything with the back. Oh, sorry, I'm moving around a little bit too quick. Let's take a look again. Better, yes. Perfect, no. Realistic expectations when a card has a hundred scratches on it. So, yeah, I think the best part I did was get out of that blue area. That was really yucky. I can still see a little bit. All right, you get it. Let's flip it over. And let's see if we can do anything with this big guy going all the way across it. That's the only thing I see on the back. Everything else looks really good. I'm gonna, I like working on them like this. So let's do that. A little bit of polish. Come on, card gods, help us out. The front is rough. At least give us one side to clean up real good. And you guys, you see that serial number? Do not put spray or polish on serial numbers. They are printed, stamped at the end of the card process on top of the clear coat. And since they're on top of the clear coat and my stuff is good at cleaning stuff off your cards, I don't want you cleaning your serial numbers off your cards, okay? So stay away from the serial numbers. Just clean up the, clean up the rest of it. <clears throat> All right, I'm happy with that. That's good. There's a big line going across it and I'm fine with that. So always look at the back too, you guys. They, I'm sure like surface counts front and back. I'm sorry, I'm moving around. I'm just trying to get you guys a light. And maybe a little bit going through his arm. You guys, I'm just super picky, you know. I'm sure you are too. But that's just the approach, you guys, when you just have the little annoying print lines or the little scuffs. Just use the polish on quick, tight little circles like you see me doing here, guys. This belt line is going to make me go mental. But even what I might do, guys, is come back at this in like an hour and just give it another shot and see what's going on. It's not going to hurt just to sit here and chill by itself for a little bit. But there are times, you guys, with these print lines, if you do a couple sessions with them, they'll lighten up. Um, one of my guys, Dominic, one of my customers, has some of the coolest card pictures he'll send me where... He'll send progress pictures where he'll have cards with like major surface issues and he'll send me three, four pictures of the progression. And I asked him how long it takes and he says, I'll, I'll leave a card on my desk all week and work on it a little bit every day. So if it's a special one, do it. Put in the time. I only put in 10 minutes here, you guys, but look, much better. Is it going to be a 10 surface? Nope, it's not because I got those little scratches under Brady's wrist. But besides that, super kick-ass beautiful card, man. I like these. The Super Bowl edition of 50. Good looking stuff, all right? So I'll come back more, guys. I got a few cards lined up that I'm going to clean and I'll demonstrate. But uh, thank you for watching. As always, I'm Kurt with Kurt's Card Care. Talk to you later.